For 100 years, UNC Student Stores has operated independently, but a new proposal could mean a change in ownership. Okay, we're all here today to show our support for UNC Student Stores. That doesn't sit well with many students and faculty. Among the displeased, student employee Jocelyn Lay. She fears a buyout means downsizing. So every time I visit a college, I want to see their gift shop. And they really are just gift shops with like three t-shirts and a teddy bear. But we have like a whole store where I do all my Christmas shopping here. And I don't want that to go away. That, that would be sad. But that's what people are predicting will happen. A company called Follett is the main contender in the bid for the stores. They're promising renovations and commission money for UNC, but many are not convinced. Students at the protest fear that a buyout by Follett would result not only in job loss, but in a loss of the family atmosphere, which the stores have been known for for 100 years. These students have penned letters to the Daily Tar Heel and marched to South Hall to show administrators they mean business. But other students, like Connor McFadden, feel that predicting massive layoffs is just speculation. So to say that before the contract is established or they've even had like some sort of conversation with Full in the first place is a little bit out there. I think it's really important to discuss the benefits and the costs accurately uh, and the fact that that's not happening with the assemblies that are being held in the student union or the one that just went up to the chancellor a couple days ago is kind of disturbing to me. I really want a critical Carolina and nothing else. Chancellor Fultz said Wednesday that no decision has been reached on the proposal. In Chapel Hill, I'm Avery Hall.